In today's video, I am showing you how to go from this to this and from that back to this using the Garage Smart Top Lifter with one person operation only. What is going on social media family? My name is Jorge Lopez and I am your sales consultant. We are located in Tomball, Texas and yes, Tomball Ford is your dealership of choice. Welcome to yet another video. Hey, in today's, vi in today's video, I am showing how I'm using the Garage Smart Top, fill top Lifter, excuse me, to remove all of these panels. So I'm gonna go step by step and removing each one of them so that you can check it out. If you have not seen my installation video, for the Garage Smart, I'll link it up in the description and on the cards up top, so check it out. Okay, so without further ado, let me show you what you need to remove these tops with one person. Okay, so the first thing you guys wanna grab is all of your bags and also your Bronco toolkit with your ratchet. Uh, this is a netting slash straps that is provided by the Garage Smart uh, lifter. This is what's uh, basically lifting the top and also inside of this netting, you will be able to set the two front panels inside of it. And I'll show you that in a moment. And this is your door bag, excuse me, your top bag. And this is the mid panel bag for the Bronco. So step one is removing the front row panels, then this one, and then I'll show you the rest. So now that we have the front row and the second row off, now it is time to work on the cargo. So we need to unscrew this and align the top to the garage lifter. Make sure that we move the Bronco back and lower this down and then continue the strapping. Also, don't forget your bolts over here. My guidelines with that brick. Eventually I'm going to be um, adding a mark there, but for right now we've got that and I know that I'm close enough when I got the second dot at the end of that brick as you can see right there. And now that is close enough. So now you need to make sure that you've got your mid panel top on top of the cargo Make sure that you've got your garage smarts aligned and ready to drop. And now we just use the app. Once you have a little bit of slack, it is time for the next step, which is adding the cargo net which is this right here. It'll be added inside. Now the moment of truth with the app. Wow. So, as you can see, the Admiral is without the tops, looking awesome. And as I told you, 
now the tops are suspended. All I need to do is just put the uh, front row panels onto this and this will get stored for a few days as we've got some really gorgeous weather. We had a uh, little bit of rain come in and we should be good to go for the next few days. So I am going to back this up here and show you what it looks like to drop it down and then basically it's just in reverse putting everything back together. So now, let's see if we can drop this down in place and see what happens. We are going to attempt to show you how to drop this. Once the Bronco is in the perfect spot, you use your app and you use your hands to kind of guide it down. As you can see right there, everything's looking good so far. Let me check it on that side just to make sure. It's a little bit inward, but that is perfectly fine because we can guide it. <laughs> All right, let me check the other side. We are good so far. We are continuing. Little by little, slowly and slowly. You can't see me, but... Okay, so far so good on the first try. And we just lowered the whole top. As you can see up top, that is completely lowered. As you can see right there. Now we should be able to close this up. Let's look at this. It's perfect. That is absolutely perfect right there. Well, there you have it, guys. This is another video regarding a Ford Bronco. Obviously, I use the Admiral here, my personal Bronco, to showcase how easy it is to remove and install the cargo top along with the mid panel and the front row panel all together suspended up in the air, as you can see right here, using the Garage Smart Lifter. Um, I do recommend the product. They are not a sponsorship of this video. I paid full retail for it. So, you know, in my opinion, I love it. I like it. If you want to see a full installation review and my thoughts about the Garage Smart Top Lifter, make sure that you check out the cards and the link to that video is in the descriptions. Hey, with that being said, thank you very much for tuning in. Please make sure to subscribe so that you don't miss any upcoming videos when you hit that bell notification. Make sure that you like this video and make sure that you share this video to other Bronco people that might enjoy the ease of removing and installing the top all by themselves. This thing is going crazy. Hey, thank you very much for tuning in. Have a blessed day and on to the next video.